You're good. Mickey here with uh, Beauties and the Chief. We're at BGG Con 2015, and I have Daryl here, who is going to tell us a bit about Bottom of the Night. Yes, I am. Awesome. Now, tell me. Oh, let's do I'll this. do it. Do okay. it. Just do it. <laughs> uh, Bottom of the Ninth is a baseball game. If you haven't already derived that from the title, um, it is. Uh, it's the bottom of the ninth inning in a baseball game, so you're playing for the final three outs. So you as the home team, aka the batting team, are trying to score one run to win it. It's, you're going into this as it's a tie game. Okay. Um, the pitching team is more or less think of like the evil empire, and they're just trying to get three outs to push it into extra innings. Oh, okay. So that's their win condition. Mm -hmm. uh, and so it's a token and dice and card game. Uh -huh. um, so first thing I gotta mention is the cards are like real baseball cards. So, nice. Yeah, right, right. Um, <laughs> nice and glossy on one side. <laughs> um, so uh, the game's broken down in five different phases. Mm -hmm. um, so the first phase is the stare down. Okay. And so that is where uh, me as the pitcher right now here would pick up these pitch tokens and they're like high and low inside the way. And I'm going to secretly guess or choose where I'm going to be throwing this pitch. Mm -hmm. Well, you as the batter have a matching set of those tokens and you're going to try to figure out or try to guess where I'm throwing this. So I'll put these down and then wait for you. Take your time. No. I was told two or three minutes. Come on. <laughs> All right. Ready? All right. I'm not and done yet. <laughs> All right. Okay. You sure? <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then we'll reveal. So I got I threw hind inside. You're throwing high, low and away. Oh no! Right. So uh, what that would mean is on the back of the player cards there's these stat charts. Mm -hmm. um, so if I have the red token, I get this ability. If I have the white token, I get this ability. If I have both, I get a different ability. Oh, okay. So knowing that I was able to throw it right through, you know, my perf the pitch that I really really wanted kind of gives me an extra incentive. Mm -hmm. If you happen to guess one of them right, you would have gotten that one. I would have gotten the one that you guessed incorrectly. Okay. And that would mitigate your your batter for the swing. Okay. Um, so let's say for this, that's what happened. Uh -huh. um, so I'd rolled my pitch die, which I have two. I have a pitch type and then the, the speed, more or less, of the pitch. Mm -hmm. And so I have a corner two coming at you. Two was eh. So I'm going to use my re-roll because I have the white token that allows me to do that. So I'd re-roll. So I have a corner oh. four coming at you. So you want to roll a four to make a hit. Anything else would be a strike. So you roll I two. Fail. And you have, yeah, your plus one, minus one token, <laughs> which makes it three. So it's nothing. So it'd be a strike. So you put your strike marker down here on your pitch count. And then we'd go right back to the next pitch. Oh, okay. So it's really a simulation of that whole final three outs of baseball. Well, and I like the it's, idea you have men and women. Oh, yeah. Here. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Uh, we have... Um, Oh man, we have quite a bit. Uh, we have when you have this in the two expansions, it ends up being like 44 players, mm -hmm. and I think about 15 are women. But it's like uh, most of the people in the game because of this, because obviously you can't get MLB likeness rights or anything. Right. Yeah. Um, so like Leslie Lou, that's my wife. So put Aww. her in here. Hannah is my co-designer's daughter. Um, Look at that smile. Yeah, Just look at that smile. Yep. So it's people that we knew or people that helped us with the game um, that we wanted to make sure we put in here. So there's kids, there's women, there's men, there's everything. So uh, we have a cyborg. You have a cyborg. Yeah. Nice. We did a Sentinels of the Multiverse. I'm not uh -huh. sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I uh, we have an expansion that's just all them. So like Omnitron X, who's a robot, he's in it. Uh -huh. uh, Mike Fitzgerald, who did Baseball Highlights 2045. Yeah, yeah. Um, he's uh, one of the promo cards, and he's got a cyber cybernetic arm, which is a nod there to 2045. Go. Yeah. So actually, his team's called like the Something Highlights, which mm -hmm. yeah. So we, we make a lot of nods to that because he played this game. Yeah. Uh, Richard Launius is in this because he helped co-design the solo version. Oh, okay. So yeah, the game plays one or two players. Well, and I, that's, that's interesting. That's you don't it. see a lot of that. So. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, that's bottom of the night. Then I'm sorry, I went way over time there for you guys. Oh, Have no. fun editing. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much. Thanks. And thank you, you have a good one, Daryl. You as well. Thanks.